In the Del Rapids School District, officials are fighting back against the vaping epidemic. Over the past couple of weeks, the school district has installed these sensors in the locker rooms and bathrooms in the high school. The sensors are not active yet, but when they go live within the next couple of weeks, they will be able to detect when a student is vaping and will alert administrators. We just want to make sure we're not providing those um, areas of the school where it's a little easier to do and get away with. The superintendent says they've only seen a handful of vaping cases so far this year, but they want to do all they can to discourage kids from using e-cigarettes. I want to protect kids. I, I don't want their health to suffer from something that I was negligent in saying was possibly an issue. The devices also have elevated noise sensors, so if an incident like a fight was taking place, a message would be sent to administrators. The superintendent says the devices are an affordable investment. Each device is well under a thousand dollars and we were able to get um, donations from a good handful, about seven um, different businesses in town. Less than five thousand dollars total has been spent so far on the devices. As they've been installed, students have had mixed reactions. We've had some very positive feedback. Um, we've also had, you know, some kids who are, you know, they're, they, they don't necessarily want to see them in, um, but they also don't always want to hear about long-term health effects because kids are invincible. Administrators want students to know they have their best interests at heart. We don't want to catch you. We're not trying to, you know, be sneaky about this. We simply want to minimize the effects.